the UC today issued a strong message to employers in the private sector in regards to employees being forced to take COVID-19 vaccination. There have been concerns raised by workers that some employers are threatening workers to be forcefully vaccinated. Various employers are using subtle words that looks like it's of a lesser impact and they're using strategic communication methods to make it look lighter. But actually what they're doing is they're pushing the workers to a vulnerable corner where they have to choose the job and the job. And they are taking advantage of the vulnerability. And actually what's happening is it's becoming compulsory. According to the Pandemic Act, COVID-19 vaccination is voluntary. However, this is not the case for some employers who are putting the jobs of the employees at risk for not being vaccinated. TUC General Secretary Clemens Kanau says any organization found to be in breach of the constitutional rights of individual workers' freedom of choice, legal actions will be taken against them. Uh, this is Brecker to tell all the employers in the private sector that the actions that they are undertaking at the moment in terms of forced vaccination, no job, no work, no job, no pay, is now being registered as a concern. So yes, over the next couple of weeks, if the issue that is now on hand developed to be a major industrial issue, all of those companies will be named, identified, and we will, as unions all throughout the country, deal with it. As a democratic country, TUC says the rights of employees must be respected. The union is calling on the government to address this matter and come out clear that vaccination is not compulsory. It's infringing on our democracy. It's infringing on our human rights. And so we need the government to come out clearly and with force state to all organizations within the country that it is a voluntary thing and that it shouldn't be forced down the throat of people. Sulisuli, National MTV News.